seemingly been making birdie everywhere. It birdied. Well, one thing he hasn't missed is the center of the club face on his irons. He has been hunting flags since he teed off this morning. And that was a beauty at the third, the par three. Yeah, this is first birdie in the final round. This is a nice par save at the fourth. Yeah, this hole is played so difficult. Hardest hole on the golf course this week. And sometimes you just gotta gut out these par putts and they feel like birdies. Par five, six. Yeah, he got this hole every day. Played it four under for the week. That's what you need to do. Catch up with the leader on the eighth. Yeah, pretty aggressive play with driver. I like this. He's in the lead and he's looking for more. This is a birdie hole if you drive it in the fairway at the eighth. Just creeps out of the rough into that intermediate cut. How about this iron shot at the eighth? Yeah, kind of nice. Be coming out of the first cut of rough, you know you don't have to worry about it really ripping back. And again, just perfect distance control. Colin Murakawa is on the tee. Merchandise this week has just been very, very cool. Second at the ninth, Morikawa. Oh, spot on. What a shot. I mean, when he is on with his irons, it is about as impressive as you'll ever see. No, oh, he's, he's really dialed it in over the last. Well, the last 18 holes, really. Remember, he played so well on the back nine yesterday. Hitting less than 40% of fairways. Yeah, and he's third on turn accuracy this year. So fighting it. Well, this is a good one, though. Much needed on this hole. Great balance and rhythm in that golf swing. And just you can just see it in his face, the confidence that he's playing with right now. Still rolling. Catching all this rollout, and that will be in the intermediate cut. Dane with this lead, center of the green. Came out a little thin, but on a good line if it's enough. You gotta think that you're starting to run out of holes. Cut. You just start this down the left. Just try not to overcut it. Oh, this is beautiful. Cruise control right now. He looks very focused. A little concerned with the bounce there. But it's fine. This was a full wedge. Which was smart because I think that takes long out of play. And you can see now just more sensible passive plays coming into the greens for Colin Morikawa. He knows that he doesn't need to. A little bit of movement around the cup. Oh, looks good. Looks great. It's just enjoying the ride here coming home. Don't see this type of advantage too often on the PGA Tour. Morikawa out in front by six. Perfectly done. Barely into the intermediate cut. That would, can be beneficial as well. Uh, this is drifting right. Oh, just hopped into the bunker. Morikawa is splashing out his third. Morikawa for birdie. And another one. What a performance. A final round 63. Morikawa dominates at the Zozo Championship.
There aren't many times in their career they have a final round 63 to close out a win. You talked to Tom Abbott yesterday, and you said that you need to get off to a good start today. You went out in 30, so talk about how much that propelled you to this victory. Yeah, uh, I definitely thought about the first two holes and missed those two uh, short putts for birdie, but look, uh, the game felt really good, and uh, knowing that you know I was two back and you just wanted to give yourself a chance with nine holes left, um, everything just kind of clicked, and uh, we were able to you know not make any errors, really, make the par putts when needed, and uh, it was nice to finish off that front nine with a birdie on eight and nine. 11 under this weekend, 67, or 66, 63. You started three over through four holes, so it was an incredible run that once you got to the fifth tee. You know, how much is that just confidence and just getting things rolling? Yeah, it's a cliche, but, you know, you really have to take it one shot at a time. Um, you know, I can go back to numerous rounds where you can think about other things. Um, you, your mind starts to wander, but... Look, uh, it was almost nice to not have leaderboards uh, starting on hole nine all the way to 15. I just wanted to keep making birdies. Uh, the goal is to get at least three birdies on that back nine, and um, we were just keeping it steady, and that's what you have to do when, uh, when you have that, that kind of build um, through nine holes. You revered as one of the best ball strikes on tour, but this could be one of the best putting performances. Uh, what caused that? You know, uh, JJ and I were, were grinding maybe for – two and a half hours uh, Wednesday afternoon after our pro-am and just trying to figure out things on, on how to read these greens, how to just get a little more consistent, take out a few variables and, you know, I texted a couple buddies um, just on certain little things and, you know, it's nice when things click like that and uh, even the ones that we're missing, they're, they're good putts, they're great looks and, um, you know, it just got to a point today where it was like just put good speed on and the ball's going to have a great chance of, of going in the hole. Us in the media have talked about the, the drought. It's been 27 months since the Open Championship, a little less than two years since the win in the DP World. How significant is this and also winning in this country? Oh, it feels so good. Um, I can't even explain it. It's, I, I knew I was going to get here at some point, um, but it's like getting your first win or your first major or whatever. You know, people keep, they start asking questions and they start asking the why. And uh, I had to really look back and, and ask myself, what's wrong, right? Right? What's the why? What's the reasoning behind uh, finishing second or fifth versus a win? Um, this win means the world. Uh, you know, my wife's out here. She hasn't been to one in a while. Um, to have the team out here just to, to be in Japan, you know, obviously being half Japanese, it's a, a lot has come through um, over the past week. We, we've had an amazing time so far, and uh, we're going to go enjoy our two weeks vacation after this. Sixth victory on the PGA Tour might be one of the best. Congratulations. Appreciate it. Thank you so much.